Ave Maria. So good afternoon or good evening to to all of you. Again, I am here, uh, Kato Pinoy, for your Father Jeremy, your host for this Franciscan Vesper. And we are already in the ninth day, Nabena of the Divine Mercy. Tomorrow we will celebrate the Feast of the Divine Mercy. And uh, if you have your bravery like this or those digital, you can pray with me. The Franciscan Vesper, we are already in the second Sunday of Easter. Okay. So let, let us start with the invocation of Saint Bonaventure. Lord, open my lips to praise your holy name. Cleanse my heart from any worthless, evil, distracting thoughts. Give me the wisdom and love necessary to pray this office with attention, reverence, and devotion. Father, let my prayer be heard in your presence, for it is offered through Christ our Lord. Amen. So our hymns will be taken at evening prayer. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. The strife is o'er, the battle done. Now is the bitter triumph won. Oh, let the song of praise be sung. Alleluia, 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 Alleluia. On the third morn He rose again, glorious in majesty to reign. Oh, let us well the joyful strain Alleluia 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 O risen Lord all praise to Thee who from our sin has set us free that we may live eternally alleluia so the antiphon and psalm will be taken from the evening prayer of the easter sunday first antiphon mary magdalene and the other mary came to see the lord's tomb Alleluia. From Psalm 110. The Lord's revelation to my master. Sit on my right. Your foes I will put beneath your feet. The Lord will wield from Zion your scepter of power. Rule in the midst of all your foes. A, a prince from the day of your birth. On the holy mountains. From the womb before the dawn I begat thee. The Lord has sworn an oath he will not change. You are a priest forever, a priest like Melchizedek of old. The master standing at your right hand will shatter kings in the day of his great wrath. He shall drink from the stream by the wayside, and therefore he shall lift up his head. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. First Antiphon, Mary Magdalene and the other Mary came to see the Lord's tomb. Alleluia. Second Antiphon, come and see the place where the Lord was buried. Alleluia. From Psalm 114. When Israel came forth from Egypt, Jacob's sons from an alien people, Judah became the Lord's temple, Israel became his kingdom. The sea fled at the sight, the Jordan turned back on its course, the mountains leaped like rams, and the hills like yearling sheep. Why was it sea that you fled, that you turned back Jordan on your course? 
mountains that you leap like rams, hills like yearling sheep, tremble, O earth, before the Lord, in the presence of the God of Jacob, who turns the rock into a pool and flint into a spring of water. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Second Antiphon, Come and see the place where the Lord was buried. Alleluia. Third Antiphon, Jesus said, Do not be afraid. Go and tell my brothers to set out for Galilee. There they will see me. Alleluia. From the book of Revelation, Alleluia, salvation, glory, and power to our God. His judgments are honest and true. Alleluia. Alleluia, sing praise to our God, all you his servants, all who worship him reverently, great and small. Alleluia. Alleluia, the Lord our all-powerful God is King. Let us rejoice, sing praise, and give him glory. Alleluia. Alleluia, the wedding feast of the Lamb has begun, and his bride is prepared to welcome him. Alleluia. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Third Antiphon, Jesus said, Do not be afraid. Go and tell my brothers to set out for Galilee. There they will see me. Alleluia. So the reading for this evening prayer one is taken from the letter of the first letter of Saint Peter chapter two verse nine to ten. You are a chosen race, a royal priesthood, a holy nation, a people he claims for his own to proclaim the glorious works of the one who called you from darkness into his marvelous light. Once you were no people, but now you are God's people. Once there was no mercy for you, but now you have found mercy. So in place of the responsory, we have a single antiphon. Altogether, this is the day the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad. Alleluia. Canticle of Mary. After eight days, although the doors were locked, the Lord came among them and said, Peace be with you. Alleluia. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. Uh, let us sing. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior. For he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is His name. He has mercy on those who fear Him in every generation. He has shown the strength of His arm. He has scattered the proud in the conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones, and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things, and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered his promise of mercy. The promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Canticle of Mary, after eight days, although the doors were locked, 
the Lord came among them and said, Peace be with you. Alleluia. Intercessions In rising from the dead, Christ destroyed death and restored life. Let us cry out to him, saying, Response Lord Jesus, you live forever. Hear our prayer. You are the stone rejected by the builders, which became the chief cornerstone. Response Make us living stones in the temple of your church. You are the faithful and true witness, the firstborn from the dead. Response Make your church bear constant witness to yourself. You alone are the bridegroom of the church, born from your wounded side. Response Make us reveal to the world the love of bridegroom and bride. You are the first and the last. You were dead and are alive. Response. Keep those who have been baptized faithful until death, that they may receive the crown, the crown of victory. Light and lamp of God's holy city. Response. Shine on our friends who have died, that they may reign forever. So at this moment, let us remember our family, relatives, friends, and our loved ones. And also let us include in this prayer of the Vesper, our frontliners and our brothers and sisters affected by this coronavirus. Let us also pray for the end of this pandemic, that our Blessed Mother and the Divine Mercy grant us this grace uh, of the, the end of this uh, virus, coronavirus. And let us pause a moment of silence for our own personal intention. Now all together let us pray the prayer our Lord Jesus Christ taught us. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. They will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. God, God of mercy, you wash away our sins in water. You give us new birth in the Spirit, and redeem us in the blood of Christ. As we celebrate Christ's resurrection, increase our awareness of these blessings and renew your gift of life within us. We ask this to our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, your family, your friends, your loved ones, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. So good evening, and Ave Maria, Mama Mary loves you.